Have you ever noticed the historical marker outside of the Terrytown Village Hall? It honors George Hurlbut, a young patriot whose bravery during a military encounter right here in Terrytown shaped American history. George Hurlbut was born in New London, Connecticut. He fought at the Battle of Bunker Hill and rose to become a captain in the 2nd Continental Dragoons, an elite cavalry unit. By 1781, the war for independence had stalled. Neither side was able to claim a major victory. Hoping to tip the balance, France sent a force of over 5,000 soldiers to aid the Americans. Captain Hurlbut and his cavalry unit were stationed in Dobbs Ferry, not far from a unit of French allies near the harbor at Terrytown. This harbor was a vital supply point for both armies, bringing flour, clothing, and other critical supplies. On July 15th, British ships sailed up the Hudson River to intercept those supplies. The American ships tried to avoid the British, but several ran aground before they could reach the dock. Captain Hurlbut's company rushed north from Dobbs Ferry to help. Armed only with their swords and pistols, Captain Hurlbut and some of the men climbed aboard a vessel near one of the grounded supply ships. They fired back at the British, but soon were surrounded. Hurlbut ordered his men to jump overboard and swim to safety. Back on shore, they resumed firing at the British. The British were forced to retreat but not before setting the supply ships on fire and threatening their valuable cargo. Captain Hurlbut and two other officers swam back to the burning ships. They extinguished the fires, saving the vessels and most of the supplies. But Captain Hurlbut's bravery came with a cost. The British continued firing at the burning boats and he suffered a serious musket wound to his leg. For two years, his leg caused him great pain. Eventually, General George Washington arranged for him to return to his home in New London, where he died in 1783 at the age of 28. Not long after the battle at Terrytown Harbor, the same French and American troops that had fought alongside Captain Hurlbut marched to Yorktown, Virginia. Together, they won a decisive battle in October of 1781, effectively ending the war. Though his life was short, his impact on history was significant. On the same tablet in front of Terrytown Village Hall, General George Washington praises Captain Hurlbut for his gallant behavior and splendid exertions. The French and American armies fought successfully together right here in Terrytown, and a young American captain's bravery and sacrifice is remembered on this bronze plaque.